why be jealous when you can be inspired instead see <coughs> oh fuck you do mother mother People often confuse jealousy and envy with each other. Uh, in my eyes, they're two different things. I know they're synonyms, but they're two different things. There's subtle difference in them. I perceive jealousy as desiring what another person has, right? But I perceive envy as uh, almost resenting the person for what they have, like wishing they didn't have whatever it is that, you know, the object, right? So looked at this way, jealousy can be a good thing, right? Jealousy can be, just like every other emotion, can be a message from the inner self to show you what you desire, what you want. And when looked at this way, instead of staying at the level of jealousy, you can be inspired instead. You can start to plot yourself about how you can get that goal, how you can achieve whatever it is that you desire, right? But of course, it's often not that simple. Uh, sometimes what we desire, it's not really what we desire. It's we desire what we think that thing will give us, right? I'll give you an example. Some people, you know, they want to be a doctor, they want to be a lawyer, and they just stay there. They pursue and they achieve their goal and they realize, uh, you know, it's, it's not really what they wanted, you know? They didn't ask themselves why they wanted what they wanted. So example, let's say they want to be a lawyer and you ask, why do you want to be a lawyer? So I can make money, a uh, lot of it. Uh, why do you want to make a lot of money? Because so I have the freedom to travel and do whatever I want, right? See. So, what they want isn't to be a lawyer, what they want is the freedom for adventure, the, on all of that, right? And being a lawyer is complete opposite of that, you know? There's a faster way to get what they really want, but instead of going straight there, there are other ways to get money, other ways to travel, that doesn't involve doing all this thing that you, you've set yourself to, to want, right? To do, so be careful and ensure that what you want, what you're pursuing is really what you want, not what you think you want, okay? And to do that, you have to ask yourself questions. Why do I want this? So what? So what? Until you get to the bottom. And then once you get to the bottom, then you can actually start to act from a place of rationality, okay? So yeah, that's how you can use jealousy as a source of inspiration uh, by not staying there and ensuring that whatever you, whatever you do decide to pursue is really what you want. And uh, so you don't waste time or energy. So yeah, thank you for watching the video. This is how you can use jealousy uh, for what it really is supposed to be as a signal for what you desire and uh, if you like the video make sure to click that like uh, subscribe and uh, once again thank you for watching I appreciate it I'm healthy I'm grateful I'm abundance I am fearless out